Hello, this is Compound Interest Stock Guy, and today we're going to be talking about some of the channels that I watch from time to time. So I hope you enjoy this video. These are just kind of recommendations for channels to maybe watch and learn a bit about. Um, yeah. So here it's a uh, tasty trade they're well known and they have uh, a tasty works um, in the USA I think maybe you can even do it in Canada actually no you can't I don't think so but there's tons of videos about options and you can even go on to the website tasty works and learn about stuff so if you're interested in options uh, this channel's got a lot of information okay um, yeah I've been watching Rich TV for probably at least a year yeah probably about a year maybe a little less um, I think when he was around like 9,000 subscribers and then he got up to like 12 and then 15,000 so yeah I've seen him grown a lot I was surprised when he had 9,000 subscribers when I saw other people had 25 or 100,000 and um, yeah this guy knows a lot of stuff I talk to him I comment on his videos and uh, I interact on their on his live stream sometimes so yeah he does uh, alert for just like live videos he'll he'll have uh, them randomly throughout the day sometimes uh, yeah he's got tons and tons of videos he's got thousand I mean he, he's an energetic guy to be able to put out that much videos and content yeah but uh, he, he talks about lots of different industries, but mainly marijuana right now. He was into Bitcoin when it was hot as well. So, yeah, Rich TV Live, he's got a good channel. Uh, I just watched her, somehow it popped up on my side. And uh, she's actually from BC as well. And uh, she's pretty cool. Uh, she's even being in a magazine. I th she's got a lot of followers on Facebook. Because sh she does these live uh, videos. And then she puts them on here. And there's like people always talking to her. But she's not very well known on YouTube. So uh, sh I think she has really good content. She basically, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but she's a really nice person and she's positive about the whole marijuana movement and she, she like teaches and talks a lot about different basic stuff about marijuana, the terpenes, the trichomes and, uh, She's got this tool from Vanderpop that sh she says people should invest in. She, she's a positive person, so she, she's got a few videos. She doesn't uh, post that often, but she's got a lot of cool different videos. Like, she's rolling a joint with uh, Broken Coast Weed. She's doing a bong hit. She's trying Can Trust. And there's a lot of people on YouTube right now that are doing these videos about uh, marijuana and um, they're consuming it from the government store. And this woman knows a lot more than like 90% of these people. I think sh she's pretty smart. Uh, Time to live. As little... all donor spices come to the party. And it has strong roots in the history of BC cannabis. Awesome. Yeah, so there you go, a little skit. Uh, this guy, 
I watch his channel a bit, not that much, but he's got some decent, like, he's got some good videos. Um, he's trying to change his video content to more uh, entrepreneurship, so that'll be interesting seeing some of his content. But he's been talking about stocks. He He's not very uh, aggressive with his portfolio. He tends to just buy things such as... ACB or bank stocks or thing, things that are just in the general market that, um, you know, every, everybody else is talking about. Uh, for the most part, I think that's basically like he won't buy a penny stock, I don't think, really. Um, but Regardless, he's he's got a good channel. He doesn't have uh, tons of, of subscribers, but he's growing it pretty fast. I think when I first started watch, watching him a, a few months ago, he had close to just 2,000, and now he's almost at 3,000. Uh, I watched this guy. I'm sure people have heard of him. Uh, to be honest, I don't really listen to much what he has to say because... He, he's become a millionaire, basically. He saved all his money from living at his parents' house, and then he decided to invest into AMD with $50,000, and he did good, but it took him eight years, and then he, like, he's persistent. I'll give him that, um, and, and he kept going. And then he's had decent success other than that. But uh, his big claim to fame was because he lives in Edmonton. And he had all the money from AMD. And so he he had time to just go to the um, Aurora Sky facility and learn about it. And know that that was going to be a really good investment opportunity. So he basically just stayed there. Um, like he lives in Edmonton, so he's able to check it out all the time. And yeah, he's just been obsessed with the roar. But but then he sold it uh, it all, and he's trying to learn options. And he he's I don't know. I don't listen to much what he has to say. I don't think he's very smart. He, as a trader, like, he can be smart in some ways, um, but, yeah, I don't, I don't know, uh, you can watch some of his videos, I just, just be careful, uh, trying to do what he's doing, uh, he's just, like, all over the place, so, yeah, it's just a warning, um, uh, but yeah, he's a nice guy, all right. So, uh, David Modell, I've watched some of his videos. He's got a lot of videos. He's been around for a long time. Uh, let's, let's see how long he's been around, at least when he started. So, in 2013, like six years, and he's got uh, 2.3 million views. So, he's got, a, he's got I think... 3,000 subscribers, yeah, there you go, and, uh, yeah, he's, he's a smart guy, so, you, I recommend going to watch some of his videos, for sure, um, this guy, he's obsessed with silver, and the financial market, uh, falling apart, which I, I agree with him, because there is a lot of debt, um, and it's good to know, but it's kind of repetitive, you know. It's everything like, oh, the world's going to fall apart. The world's going to fall apart tomorrow. And it's just like, okay, well, if the world's going to fall apart tomorrow, I'm just going to not worry about it because um, there's nothing really I can do to save. I mean, sure, there's things you can prep. You can make sure you got canned foods and things like that and water. And, you know, he's all about guns and ammo and stuff like that. 
But, uh, yeah, I don't have anything bad to say about it. I just don't, not going to watch all of his videos because it's, I've, I understand his message and I, I don't know. I'm not really going to learn much more. I mean, he, he's always going to have new content, but yeah, I mean, if, if you're super optimistic about the market, uh, he's a good person to watch and just put you down to earth and realize that things can fall apart but I wouldn't get too overly you know about every word he says but yeah and this guy is similar to Jeremiah but he's not about um guns and silver and gold as much this guy's uh He's just all about the bond market. He's he he'll look at charts and he'll figure out oh the bond market's imploding. So it's gonna and there's a lot of people that know that when when it happened a, f a few months ago when there was all that res correction kind of or re slight recession I guess and uh. But he's been around for a long time. I used to watch his videos like two years ago, three years ago. And now he's even more popular than he was. And uh, yeah, I mean, apparently he's got, he's made the list to the top 400 links. Or people, which Google wants you to ignore. And he says he's proud of that, so... Yeah, I mean, he's a he's a doomsday guy, and, uh, you know, he's interesting, but you can get kind of annoying, too, when he's constantly so negative, and, I mean, he's, he's correct, the market is effed, I'm not gonna deny that, but, I don't know, I just, I, I can't watch all of his videos, it just, like, gives me a headache, but, yeah, anyways, uh, those are the people that I watched. Um, well, I mean, some of them are pretty new. Uh, that Unity, I just found her like two days ago. But uh, yeah, I mean, check out these channels. You might learn from them. And uh, yeah, until next time, uh, peace.